So welcome to the kickoff of the shopping cart project. This is Palo Alto, California, in the heart of Silicon Valley. And these are designers at IDEO, probably the most influential product development firm in the world. IDEO has designed everything from high-tech medical equipment to the 25-foot mechanical whale in the movie Free Willy and the first computer mouse for Apple. The point is that we're not actually experts at any given area. You know, we're kind of experts on the process of how you design stuff. The rest of the team is eclectic, but that's typical here. Whitney Mortimer, Harvard MBA. Peter Coughlin, linguist. Tom Kelly, Dave's brother, marketing expert. The team splits into groups to find out firsthand what the people who use, make, and repair shopping carts really think. The, the trick is to find these real experts and so that you can learn much more quickly than you could by just kind of doing it in the normal way and, and trying to learn about it yourself. From everything I read, these things aren't that safe either, you know? Um, so probably the seat itself is going to have to be redesigned. What you're seeing here is the kind of social science, like anthropologists, you know, like you go and study tribes. What is it that, that they do that we can learn from that will help us design a better cart? Oop. Each team is going to demonstrate and communicate and share everything that they've learned today. Um, people went off into the four corners of the earth and are coming back with the golden keys to the to innovation. A deep dive, a sort of total immersion in the problem at hand. IDEO's mantra for innovation is written everywhere. One conversation at a time, stay focused, encourage wild ideas, defer judgment, build on the ideas of others. It's the team that, that's Good able idea. to really judge what the best yeah. idea is. Otherwise, and, ideas wouldn't come out? That's right. Enlightened trial and error succeeds over the planning of blown genius. And pretty soon, everybody's got their bikes up and nobody's complained, right? So it's that whole thing of trying stuff and ask forgiveness, you know, instead of asking permission. You could mount a scanner on the shopping cart so that you, as the customer, as you pull it off the shelf, would scan each item. There it is! The cart, which is designed to cost about the same as today's carts, is different in every other way. I love it. I think it looks yeah. great. At yeah. first, I was a little shocked, but I think it's you have some fantastic ideas here. The only thing that's not designed by somebody like is nature. So the trees are not designed by us. But everything you see, everything you see, every light fitting, every flower vase, every scale, every stand for fruit, everything is designed, has to go through this kind of process.